We're here in Horgau in Germany to celebrate the 90th anniversary of Metzl's well-known Marpak brand valves. Mr. Nissenen, how do we pronounce it correctly? Maypak, Marpak, and what does it stand for? Um, it's correctly it's pronounced Marpak. Its uh, legal entity's name is Metzl Marpak GmbH, and it comes from machine factory, Augsburg, Plattling, and AG is uh, same like Inc., so public limited company. What does this significant milestone mean to Metzl and the Marpak brand valves? Uh, during 90 years, Marpak has collected a significant amount of knowledge, experience, expertise. So Marpak is sharing this with all the other Metzl companies. So it has a significant contribution to our other valve brands. What has changed since Metzl's acquisition of the Marpak brand? Actually, quite a lot. So, uh, first of all, we have introduced Mapak products to our sales force. So there are a lot of new customers for us. And Mapak is representing their products, teaching our sales force to sell, and, and bringing a lot of new products at the same time as well. There's been talk of the possible demerge of Metso. What is that exactly? Uh, actually, today we have a general meeting of shareholders who's going to decide if the company is going to be split. Uh, if the, uh, they decide to do, uh, there will be two different companies, Metso and Valmet. Metso will contain the mining and construction business and automation, including Mapak in that part. And Valmet will be a pulp and paper company, having the pulp, paper and power business lines put together. Uh, we also will continue to cooperate with Valmet. So Valmet will be our key account, and we continue to cooperate in the areas where both companies get the customer benefits. Thank you very much for talking to us. It was a great celebration and we are looking forward to coming back in 10 years time to celebrate the 100th anniversary of this famous brand. Thank you so much. My pleasure.